We're gonna change my last name to tiramisu, Jeff. Oh, that's right. That's what I'm making. I have those cakey lady fingers. You can either make them or buy the cakey ones, right. and I dried them out in an oven. Ooh. And then we're just gonna we're gonna start to build the tiramisu by mixing cognac and a lot of it. You know what I mean? Okay. A lot of cognac. You know, and a little sugar with the coffee. I saw that. And Sunny's that's great. what we're gonna soak. It's good. So we're gonna, Sunny, you're gonna start to build this. Yeah. You're gonna do a quick donkey drive-by sure. and you're gonna build. But first, on the bottom, just do a little dusting of cocoa. And then we're gonna do the sort of whipped cream, egg yolk, mascarpone filling, which is just six yolks um, with half a cup of sugar. I'm just gonna whisk it together here. Chef, we oui. Beautiful. Okay. And then just start dunking and building that first layer. Mm -hmm. I've got the yolks and the sugar. And then right over a little water bath, a little low heat, you know, uh, steamy water just under simmering. And all we're doing here is cooking the eggs because I think you have to have that eggy note in the tiramisu, but you, you don't want raw eggs. No. You just don't. All right, layer one is down. I, quick dunk. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like a hot summer day. You just want to dip your toe in real quick yeah. and jump right back out Absolutely. into our a coffee mixture and right into the bottom there with the cocoa dusting. This is about ready, and mm. it's warm. So when you make it, you want to just take it off and let it cool a little bit, and then you have this. Look at nice that. and Beautiful. cooled. So light. Mm. Yeah, it's it's light and fluffy, but it's got that that classic tiramisu egg note that you really need. And to that, I have a little whipped cream. Ooh. Ooh. Bring it. That I whipped with. From the can? Sugar and <laughs> um, added some mascarpone at the end. Uh. Add the egg mix right in there. Uh. Look at that. How oh, is this not going to be good? Yeah, it's good. And you know, you have a lot of flavor notes in here. So you have the sugar and the vanilla in the whipped cream itself. And you don't have to worry too much about, you know, it's not a souffle. You don't need to be yeah. you don't need to be too delicate. You you really do want this layer mixed together. This is fun to build too. And then you just, you know, you you let this sit in I'll the fridge. Them. Definitely want this yeah. to sit in the fridge overnight if you can. Do you dust at the again? End dust? I do. Yeah. Curb Why not? And then I have a little swap here that's had its 24-hour rest period. Look at it. It's got a lot of dairy in it, so whenever you have something high in dairy, it absorbs other flavors, layer, flavors in the fridge. So you definitely want to wrap it. Yeah, Come you on, want can't onion you tell? and smoked salmon tiramisu going oh, on there. Yeah, you've got your sausage and tomato it's sauce that you disgrace. pop in the fridge still hot. And, no, you I know, do it all the, the time. Tiramisu. I'm the worst person like that. I, I'll throw the entire pot of sauce hot in the, in the fridge. And you can just cut. I think that a lot, we talk a lot about texture that you can just cut through this and eat it is another layer of texture. Just a little shaved chocolate on top. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. To be perfectly honest, I'm not a tiramisu fan. I wasn't uh -oh. gonna say that up front. More of an affogato guy for your coffee? I, love I just affogato. think I've had so many bad tricolores and tiramisu <laughs> that I, I stopped searching, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I'm not a fan of normal tiramisu until today. Until today. This is off the chart mm -hmm. good. And the cognac is the booze to use. Mm -hmm. yeah, it is because it, little... it has a little bit of a lack. It has a little bit of. It's boozy. It's a little rough. Yeah. And you kind of yeah. need it. It's it like comes in scotch hot. and honey. Yeah. You know, it's a, it's like a, a cabaret singer right at the end. This is so well balanced and so delicious. Mm. Glad I saved room for dessert.